Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Tara, a farmer from Northern California, and this channel is mainly about farming, but sometimes it's not. Excuse me. What are you guys doing over here? So apparently I left the chicken coop open last night because the chickens are out this morning. I must have left the door open or something because the chickens are out. This is so weird. Oh, you know what I bet I did? Wonder if I left the actual coop door open. The run is closed. Here's the run door. But I went into the chick, yep, look at, oh crap. I went into the chicken coop last night. Oh shoot, I hope nothing, well, my chickens are out, so nothing must have got in, thank goodness. Wide open. Everything looks okay. So I actually went in this chicken coop last night and I must have not latched it closed. So now the question is, do I let all the chickens out? I don't think I'm gonna be able to round them up. So it's like half my chickens are out. I do worry about letting them out free ranging this early because of coyotes. So normally when I let them free range, I wait a couple hours. But some of the chickens are pretty far out, so I don't think I'm gonna get them all in. I need to open up my omelets. So these are a couple new ladies I got. There's three of them. I'm actually gonna get them moved into the big coop. They've gone through their quarantine period. And then someone actually asked me if I could take their chickens. Um, they just, they've only got like three or four and they just decided it wasn't right for them. So I'm gonna get all these coops cleaned up and they'll be going in that one when I get them, I think. Or maybe I might as well just clean that one and put them in there, less work. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. All right, if you guys wanna go out, go out. It's supposed to rain today, so we'll see about that. Come on, chickens! Come on, chickens! Come on, chickens! As much as I wish they were all gonna come, they're not. So I guess they're just gonna be out for the day and knock on wood, we haven't had a coyote problem in a while. Hopefully there won't be any issues today. So this is Frankie. Frankie, you made the logo. How do you feel? Do you have any comments? Are you excited? Do you feel honored? Don't care? Okay. Frankie. So Frankie is one of my original chickens from when I moved here and I got a couple chickens, had them in the yard and unfortunately my dogs broke in and killed. I think I had three chickens and they killed two of them and Frankie was the lone survivor. The lady I had got them from actually took Frankie back and then I moved outside of my fenced yard built the old chicken coop I had, which is now my storage shed, or we didn't build it, it was my grandpa's. We moved it here and we had it here and I got Frankie back. So Frankie is the original, she's my OG. And so she's gotta be three or four years old. She wasn't a chick when I got her, so. And she is an Easter egger. She lays like a very light colored blue egg. I love her. And uh, she's on the logo now. She's been on the logo, but I've officially labeled it Frankie.
right, you guys have a good day. Alrighty, we'll head to the farm and see what I can get done before it starts raining. And uh, it's raining pretty good now. This is actually our first nice little rain of the year. So we're thankful for that. The tractors are stopped today, but we're planning on getting them back out leveling in just a few days, depending on how much it rains. Cause I think after today, there's no more rain in the forecast for a long time. But I don't think I'm gonna be working outside today. Not sure what I'm gonna do with the rest of my day, but I think this is a good time to show you guys some of the other random shenanigans I've been up to. Remember, if you guys are enjoying my channel, to hit that thumbs up button, it means so much to me. So I wasn't gonna record a video today. I am surveying all day today, and it, I just was like, mm, doesn't seem very interesting. So I haven't had my camera out all day. And I was getting ready to load up. I was done for the day. So went to load up my Kubota. This is the universe telling me there are no boring days on the farm. Um, if you guys can't tell, this is the front of my trailer. Here is the tire. I drove right over the front of my trailer, guys. So this is what I'm dealing with now. I don't always drive with four wheel drive on. I don't always need it, but I had four wheel drive on today and uh, I guess I forgot about it. And as soon, I normally put the tires right up next to this and I chain it down and I just bloop right over the top. The first thing I tried to do was hook up the chain and the ratchet strap to see if I could just pull it back. But the problem is there's this little tiny piece of metal that it's caught on. Um, you, it is right there. You can't see it too much, but it is the tiniest piece of metal that it's caught on. So basically the entire Kubota needs to be lifted up a little bit and then pulled back. Well, I'm surveying on someone else's property right now, so I don't really wanna bother their employees. And our guys are on the other side of this island with their scrapers. So it's not really that easy for them to just come to me. And my dad's about 30 minutes away. So this is a really fun situation. This is a situation that teaches me I don't carry enough tools because if I had a jack, a good jack, I could just lift it up and probably pull it back myself, but I don't. So I'll be getting a jack after this. My dad would still come, but there's another farmer that's pretty close by. Um, he's gonna try to come and help me and hopefully we can get this back the way it should be. Whoa well, there. Uh, I'm gonna go out a more, out a little more so don't pull through me. Uh. Save the day. Made it. Morgan and Jared saved the day. I did actually drive it out of the field and down this road, everything was fine. And they had a backhoe here. So, um, I mean, I just showed you guys, they lifted it and got it on there. Crisis averted and uh, so much for what I thought was gonna be a boring day. <laughs> All right, everybody. Thanks for watching today's video. Uh, hopefully I'll be staying busy. I'll catch you guys later.